Assalamu alaikum wa barakatuh, good morning shabab. Today we're gonna start in six inventors. The title of this event is inventors. Inventors are the people who invent anything, make anything new. Okay? So one of the inventors is Graham Bell, for example. So I'd say Graham Bell invented, the verb is invent, invented the mobile phone. Let's look at the new cap and concentrate your head on me and if you want to put any word in a sentence, you can do it. The first one is volcano. 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 Volcano is a type of mountains which erupts and get lava out of it. Okay? Volcano. Thanks God that we don't have any volcanoes in Egypt. Vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaner is a type of, is of sweepers but it doesn't sweep. Manually, it's automatic. Okay. Then low mower. Low mower. Low mower is a type or a machine or a kind of robot that cuts grass. Okay. Then recognize. Recognize means to know, to get the information about something. To know from the first part, I recognize that he is my teacher. I recognize him as he is my teacher. Voice. Voice is a type of sound that is related. There is a difference between voice and sound, as voice is a human thing, while the sound is anything around us like the sound of the fan, the sound of the computer, anything. Space robot is a type of robots that go to space. Oh, or a kind of boat which goes in the past and it's very, it's very um, simple. Okay? Sail, sail is a verb. Go with your boat or your boat or anything in the sea or in the river to sail with it. Steamship. Steamship is a type of all ships that works with steam. The steam is the thing that makes the engine moves. Entertain. Entertain to make something fun, to make something funny. For example, our school got a clown to entertain us. Planet. Planet. We have nine planets in our solar system. For example, uh, the Earth. Mercury? Mercury, Mars, okay. yeah, Yes. Goods. Goods means the thing that we sell or buy. The thing that we sell or buy. For example, I went to the market to get some goods from there. Egypt exports and they import a lot of goods. Okay? Then starve. Starve to be very hungry. This is a strong adjective. Starve to be very hungry. Send into space to send somebody into space to be very hungry. To be very hungry is a verb. It's a verb. Send into space to send somebody into space. Remind to make someone tell you the thing that you have to do. For example, my brother remind me to do my homework. So he told me what to do. Calendar, calendar is a thing or the, the thing that we get the dates from it. For example, the day today is uh, 8th of April or anything, so I look at the calendar and knew it. Emphasis, emphasis is a noun to stress on something, so you will have an emphasis on it. The verb is emphasize. Emphasize the verb. To emphasize something is to make it very clear. Move around like the earth moves around the sun. Where some train, take care of this. The sun train, the thing that we put on our skin to protect us from the sun. It takes the verb wear, like the clothes, wear clothes. Feel nervous to be very angry. Solve a problem to answer the problem. Let's answer the truth. Number one, a space robot is used to clean floors. No more space, vacuum cleaner or volcano, for example, and for, uh, of course, vacuum cleaner. Number two, space means related to or belongs to you. Social, local, global or personal. The thing which is personal, it's related to me, related to the person. Now let's move to the situations. Situations here to emphasize and make someone remember. Emphasizing a point, emphasize. To make an emphasis. We, we, we can use you must or remember to plus infinitive. You must or remember to plus infinitive. Look at this example. You must remember to write with. Here the infinitive. But if we replace two with that, 
you must all remember that. No, not remember to remember that. You must. Then I will put a full sentence subject verb. For example, this example. You must remember that you will have to write your own. You must remember that grammar rules are important. So after that, we put a full sentence. After you want, we can put infinitive or a full sentence. Also, we can use don't forget to or don't forget that. And the same difference between to and that to infinitive, that a full sentence. Don't forget to write well. Or don't forget that you will have to write when I put a full sentence. Then the last one is necessary to or it's necessary to or it's important to. Both of them have to obey infinitive after to. It's necessary to write when it's important to write when. Let's answer these situations. What would you say in these situations? Number one, you want to remind your father to buy your own wife so you will kill him. Don't forget to. Don't forget to get me a new wife. You have to be polite with your father, so we will use this don't forget to. Remind your brother to do his homework. You must do your homework. Or, you remember to do your homework. Or, you must remember that 